Hey guys, what's up? Zero here, and I'm going to be playing a New England Patriots versus New York Giants rematch of the Super Bowl. I'm going to look to redeem the New England Patriots for their tough loss, and since I'm showing you guys the entire game to fit it into the length I want it to be, has to be one minute quarters, so, you know, sorry running the ball, but time to air it out. Uh, I really don't feel like I have an advantage. I think that they really overpowered the Giants after they won the Super Bowl. So anyways, I'm really hoping that I can win this game. It's going to be really tight. And if it goes to OT, then I'll, I'll make a separate video of overtime. And really, I expect that to happen. I don't expect us to really separate ourselves in regulation here. And there you get an overview of Lucas Oil Stadium. 52 degrees here in Indianapolis, but we are in a dome, so we do not care. So let's get down onto the field for the coin toss. Patriots are going to select heads. It's heads. We win the toss, and I am going to receive. I am not Bill Belichick. Okay, so what side? They're going to defend the left side. So let's get this game started. And the kickoff will go out to about the one yard line, and Danny Woodhead will feel this. And he's going to get out to about the 20 yard line. Now I'm going to try to get Tom Brady into a roll early in the game. Try to seize an early lead using that double tight end pairing that the Patriots have. And there's Gronkowski over the middle for a first down. The Patriots are moving down the field at the 32-yard line now with, 40, with 32 seconds left in the first half. First quarter. Now the Patriots are just going to continue trying to get deep as Brady finds Wes Welker short. That's not going to be a first down, but it's going to move them down the field. And they're basically eating up the entire first half with this single possession. So now, going to try to keep on going with the two tight end set. If not, I at least want Gronkowski out there as he is my main target throughout this Super Bowl. And there's Gronkowski. I don't have to deal with ankle problems. So I feel like that's going to give me a bit of a slight edge over the... Uh, on the defense on the offensive side but then again my concerns are mostly on defense because of the weak defense that the Patriots do have I'm not really that concerned about scoring points and that's a big sack from the Giants as it puts us back at the second and 24 here with only 33 seconds left and counting we're gonna need to get something going quick so we're gonna send Wes Welker deep lob it up to him in the one-on-one -on -one, and hopefully he can outrun this and nope, he's not going to catch up to that. So let's just try to get in field goal range before the half is over. So my strategy was basically eat up the first half, which I've done that very effectively, I would say. And then I want to get within field goal range, kick a field goal before the half, but apparently Brady can't throw anymore. So I'm going to have to go for it on this long fourth down. Okay, so now Brady's going to drop back, looking deep. He's going to try to find Wes Welker off the double move, but it is picked off by Thomas. And Wes Welker is going to try to catch up and make the tackle. He's zo zooming down the sideline, gets down to the 39-yard line, and this is within long field goal range, maybe for Lawrence Tynes. And instead of a lead for the Patriots going into that, this one may go to the New York Giants. They're going to try to get a pass off here before the half, maybe get a bit closer for Lawrence Tynes, or just go for a touchdown here. They go short, and it's knocked out of his hands. So with four seconds left in the half, they're going to go with the long field goal with Lawrence Tynes, kicking this one. It's going to fall short. We are not going to make a return on that, so we will go into the half nothing, nothing, as expected. So now at the start of the second half, we are going to kick off, and the Giants would receive the ball in their own end zone, likely to make a return on this one. Jarrell Jernigan takes it out to about the 23-yard line, and the Giants will start their possession in the second half. With about 56 seconds left in the third, Eli Manning is probably going to drop back to pass here. 
I do not expect them to hand the ball off much. And Eli Manning takes a big shot on that one. And now Fletcher takes down the receiver after a short gain. So now, so now as we're going to see, the Giants now on offense. Second down. And that is going to be tipped away. So now Eli Manning can't get anything going by the looks of things in the passing game here. Likely to go deep on this play. Trying to find some sort of spark. He goes to Mario Manningham on the short out route. That route is, in, is interception prone. But this time it will work out for the Giants as he gets out of bounds after getting a nice gain and a first down. And that's how the third quarter would end with the Giants making a long drive down the field. So now, because I'm not expecting them to hand the ball off much, I'm going to send my linebackers in on the blitz. We can't get the pressure in on them, but Brown will tip that away. And with 57 left in the fourth, we may get a shot at this, or Lawrence Tynes. As you see, he has made 138 out of 170 kick attempts. He's been very efficient. So if they get him within range, the Patriots might be in trouble. Manning back to pass yet again, and Carter pursuing. He just throws it out there. Jake Ballard makes a great catch. Timeout for the New York Giants as it is third down and 11. If the Patriots can get a stop here and get good field position off this, Brady could possibly lead a drive down the field for the win. Manning back to pass it yet again, and he finds Mario Manningham. Mario Manningham gets away, and he will finally be taken down at about the... 46 yard line and Mario Manningham stays down. He does not give up. And this could be very good for the Patriots defense as the Giants have just lost one of their weapons. The pass rush for the Patriots. No one, nowhere to be found. That one's going to go deep. Chung. Clutch play as he bats that one down. Second down and 10 with 36 left in the game. They are well outside Lawrence Tynes' field goal range. So they still need to put a bit more of a drive together here. As now the Patriots have found their pass rush. And he can't hold on to the ball. I believe that was Jarrell Jernigan on that play. Third down and 10. Big play in this game. If fourth down is forced, the Patriots may get one last shot on the ball to make a run of the win here in regulation. But if not, then this game will go to overtime. And that is batted down. The Patriots will get one last shot. As they will, in fact, try to block this punt. So now the punt from Weatherford goes back. And that's going to be out of the play. At the one-yard line, a clutch punt from Sean Weatherford could have just sealed this game for overtime. Unless Tom Brady can pull something out of the hat, which we all know he can do. And Aaron Hernandez is hit on the play. Cannot come up with the ball. I'm sending my two tight ends deep here. Looking for Gronkowski, and I find him. Timeout Patriots at the 24-yard line now that they have some room to breathe. Tom Brady making some pre-play adjustments after the timeout. He's going to look deep here on this play. And he's going to look down the sideline for Aaron Hernandez. No good on that play. Aaron Hernandez tackled on the play, and this is basically going to be the last shot for the Patriots. Unless this game is sent in the overtime. So 
so now Tom Brady looking for Aiken. He found him. And maybe, just maybe, as time expires, Aiken outruns the defense. The Patriots have just won the Super Bowl. And a clutch play from Aiken as he outruns the defense for the New York Giants. Heartbreak as the interception was missed. Aiken, unheard of so far in this game. His first play on the field goes for a touchdown. And as, as the point after does not matter, the Patriots just want to celebrate. They're just going to get this point after over with. This game is over. I thank you all for watching. This has been Zero here, signing out.